Hello YouTubers, this is a very important video for anyone who uses my music on YouTube. There are changes coming to how you need to credit me that could affect you, so listen up. From April 17th, 2023, I'll be implementing a smart content ID system for the library. This is for a couple of reasons. Uh, number one, to protect the library from false copyright claims from third parties. And two, to enforce the Creative Commons attribution license on those who use my music without crediting me, without a proper license to do so. Many of you may be aware of YouTube's copyright management system called Content ID. It's a system that scans uploaded videos looking for copyrighted music. And if it finds something, it creates a copyright claim on that video on behalf of what it thinks is the copyright owner of the music. I've avoided using this system because Content ID can't automatically recognize that someone's given a credit and remove claims. And so it, it hasn't been compatible with my Creative Commons attribution license, which I release my music under. But this has left the library vulnerable to third parties who upload my music into Content ID under their own names, causing just widespread claims on videos that are legally using my music. Obviously, this is not an ideal situation, and it erodes a lot of trust in whether my music is safe to use on YouTube. The, the new Smart Content ID system, which is implemented by a company called Frequency Music, uh, is, is designed to scan the descriptions of videos that it identifies as using my music. And if certain keywords are present, for instance, a credit, then it will not place a copyright claim on the video. So, what this means is that I can protect the library by uploading my music into Content ID, preventing others from doing that. But really importantly, I can protect free use of my music in videos that properly credit me. But there is one thing I need you to do. So from April 17, 2023, Anyone who uses my music in their videos on YouTube will need to put a credit in the video description, not the video itself, in the description below the video. This is a fundamental change from the current requirement, which allows you to just put the credit in the video itself if you wanted to. Uh, this change is required because the Smart Content ID system, which we're implementing, can't look for text in the video. It can only look for text in the video description. So that's really important make sure that you put credits in the description. What constitutes a credit? The credit needs to at least say my name, Scott Buckley, spelled correctly. You can also choose to use my at Scott Buckley tag. This will also work. But an ideal credit will look something like this. I've already added copyable credits on each track page on the library site to make it easy for you to go and just copy and paste the correct attribution straight into your video description. It's also important to point out that this change only affects YouTube videos. Videos on Instagram and Facebook are unaffected by this change, but that doesn't mean you shouldn't credit me, okay? If you received a claim after April 17th, 2023, and you're sure that you've credited me properly in your video description, you can use the form in the video description below to request to have your claim lifted. Your request will be reviewed by a team member at Frequency Music within one business day. You can also use the form if you've corrected your description to properly attribute me after the fact. If you still have ongoing issues with claims after this, then you can get in contact with me directly and we can have a chat. This is a pretty big change for the library but a change which I hope protects your interests as much as my own. I really want the library to be an accessible and a trustworthy source of free music, and uh, I hope that this change brings us closer to that goal. If you have any questions, please don't hesitate to get in touch. The details to how to do that are in the description below. Thanks again for your continued support, um, and more music soon. Thanks.